Hey guys, this is just a real quick how-to video because I got a question from a friend of mine who wanted to know how to download the Apple trailers off of their website. Now, I think the Blue Hour has made a video about how to download um, YouTube videos and stuff, and let me take you through that real quick. Let's just pick this video here. I don't know who it is. It's, I don't know, Hannity and Combs or somebody. I don't know. Um, Dignation. So, okay. Everybody knows if you go up to Window and select Activity, It'll give you a list of all the things that are under activity that you've been doing on, on Safari, okay? You'll have all these things. As you can see, I've visited YouTube and uploaded videos. I've visited, visited Hulu and watched Bleach. You know, I've watched this Dick Nation video, Tiny Chips, and all these other things. So what we need to do is find this Skydive Prank, okay? So you go in here, you download it. There it is, YouTube Skydive Prank, 31 of 32 items. So it's obviously still downloading the video, as you can see. It's got a lot left. And that's one way you can tell where this video is. So you pop open this little disclosure triangle, and you'll have all these little confusing web addresses. But what you want to do is look for the biggest one, or one that isn't complete yet. As you can see, this one here is 142 meg, and it's just 12 point or 13 megs done. So this one right here is our movie. Okay. So all you got to do is option, hold the option key, and double click it, and it will start downloading the flash version of that video right here. Okay. This saves you from having to go out and buy an application like TubeSock to download YouTube videos. This allows you to download YouTube videos for free, even though it's in the FLV format. You can use Visual Hub or something like Stomp to maybe, I don't know if Stomp does FLV or not. I know Visual Hub does. You can use it to convert it to a dot .movie or something, okay? And that's great. It's a great, great technique to download YouTube videos for free and stuff. But what if you want to, to, to download an Apple trailer, okay? Let's try and find an Apple trailer here so let's here we go let's just pick Prince of Persia okay so now we're on our Prince of Persia thing page and if I go up to activity there's no way I can download this trailer through this activity monitor window here Apple won't allow it so how do I do that well that's fair this is fairly not quite as easy but pretty much as easy um, beyond the page where the movies at okay and because um, sometimes down, QuickTime movies won't let you download them by right clicking. Some QuickTime movies on the web you can. You can download by right clicking and selecting download. But sometimes if you don't have QuickTime Pro or some other movies like these Apple trailers, they won't let you right click and download. So we have to do it a different way, okay? So go up to your view menu and select view source, okay? And this will give you the source code of this web page, I'm assuming, okay? So what we want to do is hit Command F. Command F. Or go to edit, find, find, okay? Command F. And it'll bring up this little find window. Now, what I want you to type in is dot .mov. Boom. It will, it will find all the dot .mov files now, okay? If you click these arrows, it'll cycle through your dot .movs that it's been searching for. So this one here, as you can see, is a web address. And if I look at it, it's 320, 480, and 640. So these ain't the ones I want. These are small res. So let's go on down to the next ones. Here's our next set right here. So we have 480p, 720p, and 1080p. I want to download the 1080p. So I'm going to see. There's the dot .movie. Okay, here's the website. It starts with HTTP and goes all the way down to 1080p.mov. Should be the last little bit there, like that. Okay? So I'm going to hit Command-C and copy it. Then I'm going to go to um, QuickTime. Fire up QuickTime, go up to File, Open URL, Command V to paste that URL right in there, say Open, and boom, there we have Apple's QuickTime trailers. But the trick with this is, the cool thing with this is, um, I, can, I can download it, I can save it, and it's 1080p, as you can see. The gods have a plan for you. And all I have to do is go to File. Save as, and it will let me save as a 1080p under the name I want. You can save it to desktop, to your desktop. And I'm not going to save it, but I'm just saying, there you go. That's how you save Apple trailers, because some people like to collect them. So, you know, there's how you save Apple trailers, and that's another way of saving QuickTime movies on websites that won't allow you to download them with QuickTime Pro by right-clicking. You know, the first method, I think the Blue Hour went over a couple years ago or a year ago about how to download YouTube videos for free, going up to the activity 
uh, option. But to download QuickTime movies in the QuickTime movie format that people don't want you to download, you have to go into the view source, search for dot .movie, find the web address, and then put it in there under you QuickTime Pro or QuickTime Regular. They open URL and there you go. So I hope this has helped and give you all a direction on how to save QuickTime movies over the web that really doesn't want you to save them. Thanks for watching.